Hello, this is Lance Cleveland, author of the Store Locator Plus plugin for WordPress. I'm going to go over some of the recent issues with the Google JavaScript, Google Maps JavaScript API geocoder. This has been an ongoing issue uh, this week, and the issue is now manifesting itself this morning fairly regularly. So I'm going to show you how it manifests and explain a little bit about what it does now that I can actually show people what is going on. So the way Store Locator Plus works, if you have uh, your map centered at an address, like I do here, then what will happen is the map, when it loads on the page, will send that to Google and ask for it to be geocoded. According to Google Terms of Service, you're not allowed to store the latitude and longitude for an address. So we have to send it every time the map page loads. If you have this blank, it will use the map domain your country so it would send the address just United States which actually will center somewhere near Coffeyville in Kansas. Um, so the way this works is when you go to the map page and this page first loads it will send the address that you have your map centered at to Google and it does that using Google Maps JavaScript API and it uses the geocoder service. In version 4.3.1.8 of Store Locator Plus, there is additional debug logging that is added to the product so you can see what's going on. In this case, I'm using Firefox with Firebug so I can see what's going on under the console log for messages that are coming out of the Store Locator Plus script that give us some clue what's going on here. And as you can see when my page loaded, the address here was sent over to Google and Google came back saying zero results. And if we go to the Google Maps JavaScript API, and we scroll down to what the different status codes mean, the only thing they'll tell us is that the status code for zero results is um, a bad address, which we know is not true. And you can see that here, zero results. It was successful, but returned no results. It was passed a non-existent address. If I reload that page four or five times, and Google um, services are playing nicely with others, then this will actually work and you won't get any of these error messages and your home location will not center off the coast of Africa. Um, so that is the current option I have uh, if Google services are down, is it picks 0.0, .0 as the latitude and longitude. Um, so that's what's going on. I am work trying to work on better solutions without violating Google Terms of Service. Uh, really, it appears as though there is a significant issue going on over at Google uh, with the Maps JavaScript API and the geocoding server, as this is coming up very frequently uh, over the past couple of weeks. Uh, so that's it. That's what the details are for the issues with Google Maps and Store Locator Plus. Thank you for supporting Store Locator Plus.